Good afternoon from your National Weather Service office in Gaylord. Welcome to the latest hazardous weather briefing for northern lower and eastern upper Michigan. Today is Thursday, June 27th, 2013. Well, we've got a couple of hazardous weather highlights to talk about here over the next uh, 24 to 36 hours. Uh, first is scattered thunderstorms. They've been occurring today, Thursday, and they'll continue through this evening and overnight um, throughout northern Michigan. Um, and uh, some of those expected to con continue right on into Friday. Some heavy rain, certainly um, um, to be expected. Uh, some gusty wind, small hill also possible. And there's still an outside uh, risk of a severe thunderstorm basically through the evening hours um, along and southwest of a line from Traverse City to Holton Lake. Um, outside of that, areas of fog developing overnight tonight given the real soupy air mass in place, so be prepared for some locally reduced visibilities. The current weather map across the area shows basically an elongated trough of low pressure that sits throughout the Great Lakes region. Combine this with a soupy warm air mass and that little front that you see kind of sneaking through northern Michigan here. And that's been all conspired to basically develop some scattered showers and thunderstorms, which will again continue through the evening and overnight. As we look into the day on Friday, uh, that front basically uh, stays about where it is. Um, and uh, so we expect shower and thunderstorm activity to continue um, for the day on Friday. Um, and with really no improvement or, or no, no clearing really expected until the, the front moves south of our region, which really isn't going to happen until Saturday. Here's a forecast map for Saturday showing that front um, basically having left Michigan with drier air filtering in from the north. Still an outside shot of a shower um, over northern Michigan um, on Saturday, but most likely um, most locations will remain dry with cooler temperatures, highs in the 70s. So some welcome rain for some, um, with uh, some areas in excess of half an inch to over an inch in a few spots um, that see the uh, heavier thunderstorms this afternoon and evening. Um, we've already seen a few locations with um, well over an inch of rain. So be, be prepared for that. Um, and again, given the fact that we're dealing with thunderstorms here, probably some spots that will receive a little less thing in this graphic as well, um, you know, on the order of a tenth to a quarter of an inch. That severe uh, weather threat again through the evening hours, basically over our far southwestern zone, southwest of a Traverse City to Houghton Lake line. Um, it's not inconceivable that, that we could have a pop-up severe thunderstorm outside of that um, throughout northern Michigan, um, but the best chances are the further south and west you go. And that really is, again, through just this evening. Overnight, um, the severe threat rapidly diminishes. So we've got cooler weather slowly moving into northern Michigan um, with our rain chances diminishing as we head into the weekend as drier air moves in. Lows basically around 60 tonight with the scattered showers and thunderstorms. Again, fog developing as the night goes on. Be prepared again for some showers and storms, some of which could be strong to locally severe uh, this evening. And then um, severe weather not expected with any storms that develop on Friday. Um, and really, we're looking at dry conditions after that that really continue through the first half of next week. Our next chance of showers and storms doesn't really arrive till next Wednesday and Thursday. So um, be prepared for a nice stretch of weather coming up. This concludes the Hazardous Weather Briefing for this afternoon. Thanks for listening in. The next scheduled update is expected around 5 a.m. tomorrow morning.